you're reviewing an action comedy film that came out in 1986 that is directed by Peter Feynman, and that stars Paul Hogan and Linda Kozlowski, and that movie is Crocodile Dundee. Okay, so this movie has just started, and so far we have seen our titular character, Michael J. Crocodile Dundee, who is played by Paul Hogan for the first time. All right? Wow! We just saw that he has a large scar on his leg that he calls a, quote, love bite for some reason. That is such a strange thing to call a scar. Now he is showing Sue Charlton, a secondary character played by Linda Kozlowski, around the Australian outback. That figures since he is a bushman that lives right around there. Whoa! We just saw a real-life crocodile pop out of a river, but then Mr. Dundee came in and took it out, and thus rescued Sue from it. Now he and Sue are engaging in a conversation with an Australian aborigine. I bet he knows some things about them since he grew up in Australia. He is now on board a plane with Sue, and they arrived in New York City, and we just saw the twin towers of the original World Trade Center. Of course, given that this movie came out in 1986, which was 15 years before the twin towers themselves were destroyed in the September 11, 2001 terrorist attacks, I shouldn't be surprised. So Mr. Dundee is now having to learn to navigate the New York City landscape, as he has never even been there before this. He has become quite the conversation piece for the people who live in New York City, as they are learning some things about his life in Australia. Yikes! He just got subjected to a couple of robbery attempts, but luckily for him, they both failed afterwards. Now he is at a society dinner at Sue's father's home, that is being held in honor of both Sue's safe return and of his first trip to New York City. Mr. Dundee is going on a walkabout in New York City, and man is he proving to be one tough dude in terms of self-defense. Sue has decided to go look for Mr. Dundee and find out where he is. I guess that she must really be attracted to him. As we get closer to the end of this movie, Sue and Mr. Dundee have shared a passionate kiss. Oh, how nice. Overall, Crocodile Dundee is a great Outback action comedy packed with true Aussie charm. Join me next time when I review Titan A.E. I'm Flick James Flick, your one and only movie reviewing secret agent out there.